UFC 229 is finally here, Saturday, October 6th, and Dana White says it is trending to be the biggest UFC fight of all time. We just spoke with him a second ago, and he says that they are trending between 2.6 and 3 million pay-per-views. The big issue to me, how much is Conor gonna get paid? Because remember, Conor made $100 million when he fought Floyd Mayweather. He's been talking about it and bragging about it like crazy. So we asked Dana White that question financially, could he make the same kind of a check in this fight that he made for Floyd? And Dana basically said, yeah. And that's not all, because Dana also told us that he expects Conor to make a billion dollars off of his new whiskey, that Proper 12 whiskey that he just launched. They're sponsoring the fight. It's gonna be on the, on the mat in the octagon. And Dana says that it's selling out of every liquor store and every casino in Las Vegas. We know we've been trying to buy it in LA and it's sold out everywhere here too. It's crazy. So now he's gonna be a whiskey baron and a double champ, possibly a triple champ if he actually decides to fight Tyron uh, Woodley, but we'll get to that later. Back to UFC 229, this thing is going to have a ton of huge celebrities. We saw the VIP guest list, massive. We're talking Elon Musk, the Tesla guy. We're talking Matt Damon, uh, Anthony Kiedis from the Red Hot Chili Peppers. Megan Fox is gonna be there. Robert Kraft, the owner of the New England Patriots is gonna be there. Chris Pratt from Jurassic Park, also, from Guardians of the Galaxy 1 and 2. This is going to be an amazing fight. Connor versus Khabib, that's the main event. The undercard is also insane. Tony Ferguson versus Anthony Pettis in Tony Ferguson's first fight back after knee surgery. That's gonna be great, you don't wanna miss that. And also Derek the Black Beast Lewis is fighting Alexander Volkov and Derek the Black Beast, he never disappoints, man. That guy always comes ready to fight, it's great. Plus in the women's division, you have Michelle the Karate Hottie Watterson, she'll be fighting Felice Herrig. By the way, Khabib, 26 and 0, has never lost a professional fight, also, fought bears back in Russia. He's one of the most ferocious fighters in the history of the sport. Don't miss it, it's gonna be awesome, October 6th.